Yeah, Russ, this is a follow-up. This is a actually about an inch and an eighth gap with uh, no hydrogen. This is just the arc. I have everything shut off. There could be residual, but it's very, very little. Uh, what I've done here is I've salted the electrodes a little bit with sodium coming out of the cell. But you can see uh, the blue. Now what I'll do is I'm going to turn on the uh, electrolyzer here and we'll see what happens. It starts getting a little more sporadic. See a little bit of arc spark starting to dance. See the arc dancing on that electrode? That's with the, uh, I'm running here about 65 amps. Oops, there we are. And I've got the meter all not quite buried, about 14 and a half volts. Punching close to 68 amps now. But you can see how that yellowish color, because there's no filter, it's the sodium. So anyway, we're going to turn off the power supply now. This is me with my finger here on the rocker switch. And you can see the voltage dropping. And immediately the cell, ch the arc changed. Now I'm going to bring it back on and we'll just watch the arc. And you can see the yellowish. Tinge in it. I'm going to shut the electrolyzer off. And you can see it starts changing. It's more bluish and the arcs are dancing around a little more. It kind of quiets down. Hopefully you can see that. I'll shut up. I don't know if you can hear it or not. I'm going to turn on the gas now. Now I'm going to shut off the gas now. Okay. Anyway, that'll uh, kind of give you an idea what that's the unit running again. All right. Here we go. Two minutes, 50 seconds. Mark.